in this episode, Rocket Suplex, Wheels on the Ground, Leviathan Hunter, Mobile Bunker. Close combat was always a major part of Crossout. Before, it always came down to who can grind faster, so it was not important to choose the right attack angle and weapons. Ever since the introduction of Harpoons, close combat fighting has a whole new dimension, grappling. Now you can limit your opponent's movement and hold them in an iron grip. Velodya S went far ahead and introduced throws and takedowns. Using his one-of-a-kind hovercraft, he takes a hold of the enemy and throws them on the ground, smashing them to pieces. This is physics in action, folks. Making 1,000 gold in a process. Good job, man. Please, keep going. We all know about Big Black Scorpions, a game mode where the best and fastest sharpshooters fight using railguns, four wheels, a jet booster, and no armor. Usually players rely on boosters since they allow them to evade enemy shots and assume best possible positions. Stray Shot 1 thinks that jumping is unbecoming of a true raider. He firmly plants his wheels into the ground and proceeds to dispatch all his foes. Hey, I'm serious! 12 frags and no deaths! Only once he uses his booster, and probably by accident too. Sir, for your amazing skill, you have just earned 1000 gold. Nice! After buying their first combine, most players venture out into PvP battles and expect to be dominating all in their path. Firmarok is not like that. He knows better and uses his combine to its full potential, going after a much tougher target than a regular player. To great effect as well. All encountered colossi are promptly transformed to a heap of metal junk using two combine units. This is a good demo of what these babies can do when used right. The author will soon get the prize. Thanks. Crossout Storm Warning is all about fighting tooth and nail just to stay away from the deadly storm. Players give it their best, desperately trying to outrun the elements. But there is another unexpected way to victory, courtesy of Zeos. Instead of running as far away from the deadly wall of sand as possible, he puts his money on survivability of his craft, and once the storm fully covers the map, he just stops and waits out. While his remaining enemies see their HPs wither away quickly, he chose the right ally, the time itself. With this build, the time works for him better than any weapon ever could. His cunning just brought him 1000 gold. Awesome! Now it's time to pick the best comment of the past week. Christian Aura says, Roses are red, violets are blue. Tanks don't have to be slow, as Cross888 has shown you. Please respond to your original comment with your in-game nickname and email address so we can send you your prize. Please be advised that the prize may take up to 5 business days to be added to your in-game account. Thank you for watching this episode. Okay, let's recap the three simple steps on how to submit your video to Crossout Shell. Step 1. Record and put together a video. Attention! The submitted video must be made by you, must be published for the first time, must have public access for viewers, and must not violate any copyright laws. Step 2. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the like button below this video. Step 3. Upload your video to YouTube and send us a direct link to Crossout Show at Gaijin.ru. The covering email should contain the desired category for your video, your in-game nickname, and the email address registered with your game account, so we can send you the reward should your submission win. Every week, four submissions will win 1000 gold. We will also be awarding the best comment of the week with 300 gold. So get your engines revving, make some content, send it to us, or simply watch and comment. Either way, we got plenty of gold to go around. See you in the week.